All right, which side of a leopard has the most spots? <laughs> the outside. Hi everyone, I'm Domily Keith with the Black Voice. April is National Humor Month. And if my joke didn't make you laugh, well then this woman sitting next to me, she certainly will make you <laughs> laugh until your side hurts. Thank you. <laughs> Comedian Crystal Powell is hosting a variety of charitable events. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thanks for having me. And you are hilarious. Thanks. You make me cry all my makeup off <laughs> because I'm laughing so hard. So tell me about some of your upcoming events. Well, we have, um, for starters, we're kicking off with a private event at the Ronald McDonald House, and we're doing um, just some fun things for kids that have terminally, uh -huh. terminally ill um, diseases. That's wonderful. And why did you want to do that for the kids? Because laughter heals. Mm -hmm. And as a child especially, we want you know them to be having fun and playing with, with rocks and throwing stones and stuff instead of being, you know, having to deal with such a, you know, horrible situation. Yep. So if we can bring some laughter for a few minutes, you know, and take them away from that moment, that's what we want to do. Laughter is certainly the best medicine. Absolutely. So what are some of the other events? So that's going to happen on Thursday morning, early Thursday. Thursday morning, mm -hmm. then Thursday evening, we have the Hoop for Humor. We're <laughs> going to be hula hooping <laughs> and burning calories, some ladies, and that's going to be fun. That's Thursday evening from 7 to 9 p.m. at the DJ Spin Academy. And then Saturday, we have the Stop the Silence Cancer Walk. We're bringing awareness to all of the survivors and people that are actually su experiencing that. I'll be co-hosting that event. Mm -hmm. And, and that's, that's personal to you because your best friend's mom. Yes, my best friend's mom um, passed away from pancreatic cancer and I used to walk with her. Mm -hmm. And before we would actually get to the race, she would have so much anxiety because she oh was my. just knowing what had her there at that event. So when I was you know, presented with this opportunity, I was like, of course, because yes, we're we're wanting to be healthy, but at the same time, everyone that is there, they have experienced this or dealt with um, with breast cancer in some or cancer in some type of way. So mm -hmm. if I can bring a light side to that, then I'm doing my job and I'm having fun at it. <laughs> yeah. And and you've experienced tragedy. You know what it's like to be the funniest <laughs> person in the room and the saddest person. Absolutely. In the room. I lost both of my parents, um, but my mother. I lost my mother suddenly. She had a massive ha heart attack, and that's mm -hmm. what actually pushed me into comedy because I'm from Texas, but when my mother passed away suddenly, I was so upset with the world, I just packed up my car and I went to California. Wow. And I was just like, I, I was lost, I didn't know what I was gonna do. And I just was like, you know, I've always been into comedy and, and having fun and goofing around <laughs> that used to get me out of trouble with my mom. So I was like, why not? Because you know, I was just upset and it, it was a gift from her because I'm from the South. We're close to our parents. I would have never left. Wow. I would have never left. So that was my mother's gift of saying, you know what, go out and be great and do you and share your talent with the world wow. because it's a talent. And Even I love it. Even when you thought she left you, she hadn't left she you. Hadn't she hadn't left me. She's still gifts. with me <laughs> like, on a daily basis. And you've, you've uh, blossomed into a wonderful career. You've worked with Robin Williams. And uh, when can we next see you here in Houston performing and on stage? Sunday night at the Joke Joint Comedy Showcase. I am producing my first comedy show myself. It's Crystal's Comedy Corner. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> my headliner will be Rodney Perry, who's oh, a dear funny. friend and a mentor to me so it's going to be a great show and it's Sunday April 26th at 8 p.m. and you can get tickets at crystalscomedycorner.eventbrite.com crystalscomedycorner.eventbrite.com that's it all right <laughs> <laughs> and there we can find tickets and this is going to happen on Sunday at the joke joint yes in at South 8 p.m. Mm -hmm. all right I can't wait to see you <laughs> <laughs> and we will see you again next time with more of the black voice